Armenia's new Prime Minister Nikol Pashinyan has been setting up his cabinet after leading weeks of protests that forced the previous leader to step down. Well, one prominent voice during the demonstrations was that of Armenian-American rock star Serge Tankian. The frontman for the band System of a Down tells Al Jazeera what's ahead for his country after days of civil disobedience toppled what he calls an autocratic government without a single bullet being fired. As an artist, we've stand, stood up to injustice, not just in the U.S. and elsewhere in the world, uh, and for human rights, but also in Armenia. And as artists, I've always believed that you should tell the truth, whether, whether it's popular, you know, or not. We've had a uh, very typical post-Soviet oligarchic kind of system in place. Uh, that's that's been ruling the country for since independence in 91 and people were over the years voting with their feet by leaving the country the high rate of depopulation in the country uh you know one third of the people under the poverty line and and high rate of unemployment and and injustice in the courts injustice in law enforcement people have had enough I think uh, Nigo can start reforms in the executive branch, the law enforcement, uh, some, some judicial reforms. Uh, he's going to try his hardest to get um, electoral uh, reforms done through parliament. I don't know how easy or difficult that's going to be, but obviously that's a challenge. And as long as the people are persevering and, and patient through the process, and when I say patient, I don't see these reforms taking tens of years. I'm talking about a few years, maybe up to five years of completely re-establishing this country in a, in, a, in a more positive light. Not that this country is a completely negative light either. You know, I think we've made certain amount, amount of progress over the last 20-something years since independence. But this is a whole new beginning that's creating this incredible hope.